From the dawn of time, our ancestors have left us with the tales. Stories which speak of things that they have seen and lived alongside by, feared, respected and even looked to some of them as godlike. Modern man refers to such things as spirits, extraterrestrials, demons, cryptids, creatures and entities of all kinds and so much more. These things and tales are now referred by most as myths and legends. But there are those of us that know what our ancestors spoke of was the truth. Those of us that have become obsessed in searching for answers and finding out the truth are here. We need the truth. This search brings us into the realm of the unexplained and unknown. It brings us on the trail. The search for living legends. Please join JR and I on the quest and welcome to the search. Welcome everybody to another edition of On the Trail in Search of Living Legend. So I'm your host Jeremiah Fountain with my faithful you know, co-host and partner, Mr. Nathan Rudd. Nate, how's it going, man? Going good, Jeremiah. Good, good. Good to see you, as usual. Good to see you. Glad, uh, glad you're here. A couple of the others were absent, a couple of the guys, but that's all right. I think we can handle it. Um, yeah. I just want to say we are honored tonight to have, uh, in my opinion, the best Orang Pen Deck investigator in the world, Mr. Dolly Sander <laughs> Diputra. Good friend of mine, known him a long time, done a lot of interviews with him. How you doing, my friend? How you been? Hello. You doing all right? I'm good. Yep, I'm really good now. Good, man. Good, good, good. So, what's been going on, man? You, uh, really? What's been going on? Anything new? Any, you've been uh, no, the- no, 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 nothing new because uh, you know uh, I have uh, I have uh, some uh, some problem when when going to expedition because uh, today also from the COVID nineteen uh, we just uh, stay at home you know n- not allowed to uh, to do some expedition in the forest because um, the national park is not 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 give some permit to us to going to expedition you know. Oh, yeah. that's bad. I got you. I got you. Okay. So you have All to right. get a permit. You have to get a permit to go into a certain area, then, Dolly. Of course, because yeah, because yeah, of course, because in Indonesia, before we go to the forest, we have to make some permit with the national park. Uh, yeah, something like that. You know that that's a rule from Indonesia. You know. Gotcha. Yeah. And okay. they're, spe- they're especially strict in the area. You know, in the areas you go. You know, I know. Yeah. Um, but listen, uh, can you do me a favor? I know Nate, Nate um, and a lot of and a lot of our new viewers out there are not that familiar with Rang Pendek and Orangadang. Could you give me a quick, uh, quick little rundown, quick little description on uh, Rang Pendek? Throws up for a second. Yeah. Hey. You hear me, Dolly? Tough connection from there. Yeah. Dolly? Hello? You there? Yes, I'm here, but I think a bad connection, you know. Can you repeat yeah. again? Yeah, it's all right. It's all right. You're good. Um, like I was saying, Nate and a lot of our viewers, they aren't very familiar with Orang Pendek and uh, Orangadang. Could you uh, give us a little uh, description one by uh, for each of them? Okay, one by one from the creature. Okay, the Orang Pendek yes, is, is, yeah. Yep. Uh, which one you want to hear first? Pal, my Pendek favorite. Or Pendek, you know that. <laughs> Pendek's my favorite. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, the Orang Pendek is like, uh, you know, uh, Monkey like a uh, work paper doll, yeah. I have to do some research at many locations for looking for the orang pendek. Uh, it's not only in uh, my area, uh, you know. You know, if uh, that researchers looking for orang pendek only in the Kerinci National Park, so also Gunung Tuju, 
But uh, my research is going around the Sumatra, from the uh, Jambi province, uh, West Sumatra province, also Bengkulu province. Because, you know, the first uh, sighting of the orang pendek in, uh, in uh, Bengkulu, you know, that yes. make me uh, make me interesting uh, to search uh, the orang pendek uh, at, at all of the Sumatra, you know. So I was thinking that the orang pendek is creature from Sumatra. It's not from the, uh, only... It's not from Kerinci only, you know. Okay, I see what you're saying. I see what you're yeah. saying. Um, do you think there's more than one type? Two different species uh, of pendek? I think uh, the, the same type. Uh, only, the, the, uh, only the name different from uh, each other area, as you know. Uh, it's like uh, from the, the Kerinci at my places and different name with the West Sumatra, also from the Bengkulu, you know. I think okay. something like that. Yeah. Okay, that's right. The, 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 the describe is describe on uh, I think it's the same, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Kind of like here, Nate. We're like, you know, they'll call you know certain tribes call them scoop them, certain tribes, yeah. you know, but we're really talking about the same creature sure. most of the time, you know. Um. Now, it, uh, height wise, what are we talking? That one spot he gets in. Hello. Mate, hey, it's all right. Don't worry about it. It's not your fault, man. You're all the way okay. over there. No biggie. Um so we talk about the Rangadang now. Uh well, I wanted to get hear a little more about Pendek. Uh can if it's not a problem. How uh, what are we talking for height? The height of our, our, our pendek is like a one meter, you know, uh, in in my 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 rural, you know, uh, only one meter, and then, uh, yep, uh, black, uh, uh, you know, some some people talk about the black fur, and then some some people talk about the gray fur because uh, so many many uh, uh <clears throat> many many type of the description from the people, but I think. Uh, uh, the through is the the black fur, you know. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And they're pretty. Um, that's what I'm looking for. They're pretty stocky, right? Yeah, right. Pretty stocky. Yeah. Pretty stocky. Yeah. Um, something else I was going to ask you about about uh, ring pen deck. Now, do you uh, do you think they spend a lot of time in the trees or mostly on the ground? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I think it's something like that. No. Yeah. Go to both. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Just curious. Now, the one I'm, the one I really, uh, Ranga Dang, I know a lot of people. Am I saying that right? Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Right. Ranga Dang. I, I always <laughs> afraid I'm going to screw that up. Um, tell us about, tell us about that. Even I forget half the stuff you've told me over the years about it. Uh, it's, it's a big, big guy, right? Right, the orangutan is mean the big guy, you know. I think, uh, you know, uh, the first time I, I, I look for orangutan in, in, in West Matra, you know, the story is, the story is I'm looking for uh, the information, you know. Yep. Okay, can can uh, can I leave uh, for the second? Yeah. I, I need to take something. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Wait, wait. Can you get interesting? It's okay. Yeah. Can you get interesting? He's yeah. across the world, man. It's all good. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. His uh his when he talks, you'll see you'll see what I mean when he gets into his encounters. Yeah. His uh or is it like, you know, when he talks to the natives, gets yeah. I'll bet, yeah. Yeah, I want to hear if they throw rocks or what are what are the interactions they get. You know, I, we, we him and I never I never asked him. We that. should ask I, him that. three freaking times and I've never asked him that. I wonder if the some of the um the some of their behaviors like Sasquatch, you know, some of the stuff they do. You know yeah. question, man. And I'd like to also ask him, do they believe it's an animal or like an ape, or do they believe it's a tribe, maybe another tribe or something? I know easy to say to that. To yeah. I'm not gonna spoil it for you. That's okay. That's all right. <laughs> I don't want to spoil that one for you. But uh 
Let's put it this way. He, uh, if I'm not mistaken, I, I'm not going to say anything. I don't want to ruin it. Let's just let it play out. Let it play out. Yeah. But I, I got to say, the answer he's going to give, I, I got to agree with him on it. Yeah. With this particular being, you know. <clears throat> Nope. We're gonna the good dang then go back to that after. I'm trying to look for the good uh, good places for connection, right? Not a problem, man. You take your time. We're just happy to have you on. Hello? Yep. Yeah. You're perfect, man. Hello? Yep. Yeah. Perfect connection. I'm yeah. Pretty okay. pretty warm pretty warm there right now, Dolly. Not really. What's not really to you? What's the temperature? Okay, okay we, can, we can continue, but uh, another creature. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Start. Do your thing. Ring a dang. Let's hear about it. Yeah, you know, first story, uh, I was visiting uh, the West Sumatra looking for um, these creatures, you know, before looking yeah. for the orphan, of course, you know, and then I did some interview with the local people and then and then I found uh, the good information from the West Sumatra, I think from the all, all men, I think. Uh, and then he talked to me about the very big ape in, in forest, something like that, you know, so... Next next day I'm go, I'm go, I was going to the expedition then looking for uh, looking for these creatures you know right and then I get some result you know got a very very big uh, footprint in the forest you know yes <clears throat> yeah so after uh, I got the footprint then I saw to the uh, local village you know and then he told to me like uh, okay this uh, that's I mean you know because uh, this uh, footprint I, I saw a couple of years ago, something like that. You know? Yeah. So I can say that this this type of the wrong get down, you know. So, uh, oh, I see what you're saying. Okay, I see yeah. what you're saying. Now, how how long is the how long have the locals been talking about? Because you know, before I uh, before I got talking to you, before I knew you, I, I had never heard of it. Uh, ring a dang. How yeah. is it? Is it a pretty pretty well accepted fact over there that they're they're real? I you know think how? The, yeah, maybe it could be something like that because uh, these creatures, you know, have for the long time uh, never found from the local people, you know, because uh, uh, I think uh, um, about the twenty years ago in in forest still still very sticky, you know, uh, for today. And I lost you for a second, bud. Lost the audio. Yeah. Hello? Yeah. What lost you? Hello? Uh, yeah, yeah, I can hear you now. We, we were leaving off... Uh, Talking about the villagers and uh, if they, how long they've been talking about this creature. Yes. Can you hear me? Yes, perfect. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because I saw you like you know, uh, mute my my phone, you know, my microphone. <laughs> oh no! Yeah, I was trying to unmute you. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, how long? It, like I, you know, how over here, like you know, there's a lot of people that have problem with Sasquatch, you know, you know, most people are, say, oh, it's bullshit. It's not real. Well, guys like us, we know it's real. So we've seen him face to face, you know. Um, uh -huh. Is it like that there? Hmm. Yes, always like that, <clears throat> because we're in the cryptozoology uh, subject like this, you know. Many people sometimes trust what we're talking about. They sometimes 
It's not uh, it's not to be like that, you know. It's like yeah. in Indonesia, you know. Uh, you know, when we do some research, we're not going to search for um, uh, the the cryptid first. We, uh, right. We give some yeah, we give some question for the uh, for the villagers with like uh, an unknown animals or a strange animal in the forest, something like that. So uh, we have to looking for some folklore from the village, you know. I think something like that, you know. And then after that, um, the the villagers told told to us about the uh, uh, strange uh, the animals. And then after that, we can going to expedition to the forest for looking for some uh, uh, good okay. results. Some expedition, a very very long time expedition in the forest. So, yeah, I understand. So you kind of <coughs> they lead you, you know, you start small and let them let them lead into it. Kind of like how, uh, kind of like, you know, when you're talking about it with Native American tyranny, you know how sometimes it can be kind of fragile to talk about. You know, that's kind of I think mm-hmm. that's what he's kind of saying. You know, you got to let them yeah. kind of bring it up sometimes. Um, you know, because here, you know, here they're to them the Native Americans here. It's not a question of whether they're real or not. They know, you know. If I mean, do you agree, Nate? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yep. They know yep. they're real. They there's no question that they're they're real. Mm-hmm. Now, how tall do these uh orangutan get? Sorry? How how tall? Uh based on the discretion from the witnesses, he talked to me about the two meters up, you know. The two meter two meters would be six. Yeah, okay. So seven seven feet and seven feet up and up. Fit maybe in, in the year. Yeah, in our terminology, yeah, I understand. I think it's just something like a big foot uh, in the uh, United States or Sasquatch. I think something like that, you know. Yeah. Okay. It could be. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, but you so, know, the make me interesting is like the footprint of the orangutan so different with the orangutan, you know, because uh, orangutan is more like human uh, footprint, you know. Yeah, they're so interesting. So interesting, very interesting for me. <clears throat> very interesting, and, and it, it it blows my mind. They're so much different than uh, the tracks we find here. Mm. I mean, so much, so much different. Um, you know, the width, especially the widths, on you know those those tracks you show me here, just it's just unbelievable, unbelievable. Um. Now, uh, do you have any, um, as far as any, uh, if you don't want to, you don't have to, but do you have any uh, eyewitness stories you can share without naming any names? Okay, yeah. Which one story? I, I, would, I would like to tell you everything about this story because, I know. Uh, not, you, know, because you know, not many people are interested with the wrong other because uh, I think uh, many cryptozoologists come, come to Indonesia only look for the appendix. But you know, basically, so many uh, cryptids uh, in in Sumatra, you know, like uh, like I said before, the, the Sumatra is like even of the cryptozoologist uh, subject, you know, because uh, yeah. many many creatures, something like that. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. which one you want to uh, hear about the uh, witnesses, Rangada or Rampenek? I think uh, the Rampenek is. Uh, more thousands uh, witnesses. I, I did some interview with them, you know. Orangada so only few, uh, only only few, only few, you know, because uh, not okay. many people know about interesting about this. You know? yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just yeah. Just surprises. Surprises. Maybe 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 a little bit of each. Maybe one of each. Couple of each. That'd be that'd be if you could do that. That'd be great. Okay. Yeah. The Orangada is. Uh, I think uh, from the old man, very old man. Uh, I think about the seven, 70, I think, 70 years old when I did some interview on the 2014 in West Matra. Uh, you know, I did some interview, I think, about the 10, 10 people, something like that, you know? Yeah. yeah. Um, that that mix uh, for age, uh, some some old, some for the young man, because uh, young man working for the NGO, for the Forest, and then he saw the it's like the big, very big monkey uh, was yeah. eating the durian, you know, eating fruit, 
in in forest though so he he was scared so he, he was go run away from from that location you know <clears throat> that from the young man and how how did he give you a, a description on the high the any facial descriptions or anything yeah the co color Star, yeah i think uh, yes like i said about the two meters you know yeah very 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 strong because uh, some witnesses also told to me he can broke the tree in, in, the, in the forest you know? yeah. right Right. Okay. Right. I thought, you know, last time we talked, I, I could be imagining this and I, and I could have heard it somewhere else, but I thought it was you that told me a story that someone had seen one that was uh, ten uh, over 10 feet. 10 feet? Yeah. 10 feet. I, I, it might have been you, it may not. I could be mistaken. It's been a long time. Is it about the uh, tall of the screeches? Yeah, it was a good, good thing. I thought, yeah, yeah, it could have been. It might not have been you. It might not, I might be getting you confused, but. Uh, this is this is some like uh, uh, I told to you because uh, the very very tall. I think uh, very tall, about the two meters, and then uh, I, I think uh, uh, many ways is uh, about the wrong guy. On always told about the, the same tall, tall about these creatures, you know. But uh, these creatures are at location in the West Sumatra is not in Princes area. You know, in Princes is most popular about the world and the creatures. You know. I got you. Okay. Yeah. Now, do, do they, uh, is there any reports of uh, them being aggressive? Yes, I think I'm going with that. You know. Is it really? Yeah. Is it orangutan? Orangutan, yeah. Yeah. Seems like it's kind of a touchy, uh, touchy subject, so I won't push you on it. But we, uh, we, we deal with it here too because you know, a lot of get a lot of reports of Sasquatch getting very aggressive. Um, now on the other hand, the, the ring pen deck, you know, they 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 don't get aggressive at all, do they? Mm. Yeah, I think it's a little bit because, uh, I think about the two years, I I, I stopped my my expedition to the forest there. Yeah. So not not to not to know much about this. Uh, hmm? What happened with the forest now? Yeah. Yeah. Now, uh, Nate, you had a couple questions you wanted to ask him. Yeah. Yep. Del um what what are some of their uh, some of their uh, behavior as far as uh, do they do they do tree knocks? We get a lot of uh, really loud. It sounds like they're hitting a tree with a stick mm -hmm. over here, mm -hmm. and we get a lot of whoops. We get a lot of screams, a lot of vocalizations. Do you get <coughs> that same thing? You get the same thing with uh, Pendek and the uh, and the other Long one. Yes, yeah. yes, yeah, because yeah. Uh, the sound is a different thing because orangutan is, uh, or, or, or I thought about the orangutan. Orangutan is like a very, very deep sound because you know when, when I make a pouring something in the forest, pouring footprint. I mean, I heard some some sound, like very mm. very deep. It's not so different with the, another animals. I think something like that. You know, so I followed the sound with uh, my friend uh, going to that. But the sound is so uh, it's like a very very uh, far, far and far away again. But when we come back to the uh, our uh, our camp, the sun is just more near, you know. Mm. Very near is something like that, yeah. Wow. So they're they're moving fast. It sounds like they can cover a lot of ground. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. Which sounds familiar. sounds familiar, right? <laughs> yeah, sure. right. Yeah, sounds familiar. It sounds like they scared to me when they was in the forest. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Hey, how about do you guys uh, is in in some of your reports is <clears throat> excuse me do they throw rocks? Uh, we get a lot of that here too. Is uh, there rock yeah. throwing stuff like I that? Call her, Ma. Sorry. Jesus Christ, Mom! She doesn't have a phone. I'm on a fucking oh! I already texted. Okay, can you repeat again? Uh, yeah, sorry. 
Uh, would you ask him name? I'm sorry. Well, I, was, I was wondering if uh, if you get the, the rock throwing, do they throw rocks at people um, like they do here? You know. Yes. Yes. I think uh, some like that. You know, uh, because we we some little rock shade. Uh, well, it's just hard to say. We hard to tell about the. <clears throat> Well, my experience because oh, yeah. sometimes sometimes uh, we could get some scare in, in forest there yeah, because yeah. The sounds is so very close and then we follow this sound and it sounds so very go fast around the way something like that but you know in in the, the track of the, these creatures is like the sticky stick in 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 the forest you know yeah yeah sounds it, familiar it does it awful very very i know what i wanted to ask you now we we get here we get a lot of where they'll mimic other animals where a coyote or a wolf or owl owls they'll they'll mimic other animals and they 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 get it almost perfect but you can tell that it's not they get it they get it wrong they get it almost perfect but there's something a little off about it. Do they do? Do either of these two creatures do that? Do they mimic other animals? Uh, it could be, you know, uh, it could be uh, uh, they do something like that, you know. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Interesting. Very interesting. Yes. Sometimes, you know, <clears throat> my, my experience in, in the forest when they go to uh, look for expedition in that part of Sumatra. And then, the, you know, what one, uh, one, one makes me some confusing is uh, uh, the local people come to my camp and then ask me to leave the forest because, you know, because they, because they, they, they told to me this forest is, uh, is not allowed to do some expedition also. He asked me some money uh, to stay there because uh, he, he told to me he has to buy forest from the authorities, uh, forest, you know, something like that. Because because he don't want well, what, what I do in the forest. He knows what what they expect ex activities. I mean, it's like the illegal logging or looking for some forest and something like that. You know, hmm. they do the same stuff. Yeah, I think it's just not the same problem in the United States, you know. Because no, we, no, I know what you're saying, but <laughs> kind of, he, he knows what I'm saying, kind of similar in a way, you know. Similar, yeah. Similar, yeah, I know, I know, I know what you're saying, Dolly. Uh, I know what you're saying. Now, uh, color, color of the uh, gedang. I mean, what, can it can it vary, or is it, or are they one standard, standard color? Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's just more like a, like a brown. Okay. Like brown, yes, because the uh, witnesses look to me like that because it's more brown and it's, it's not not black, you know. Okay, so never heard about black. Yeah. That's interesting. That's black, interesting. Black one. That's interesting. Same with the pandak, correct? Yeah, I think it's same, but only the different of the size, you know. Yeah. 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 Yeah, it's uh, they, they they're to me they, they're very uh, very enthralling. They, they yeah. really cap captivate my mind. I think they're very uh, as far as cryptozoology. I know what I want to ask you, and you don't, you might not want to answer it on radio. Uh, what do you, do you think that the orang pendek is more of an ape or more of some type of human nature. Yeah. Um, half. I think the half, you know. Fair enough. Really half. Okay. Yeah, because, uh, yeah, uh, my my witness has told to me, he like ate but uh, walk a big down, you know. And so he eats some, uh, like, you know, oil in the, in the oil or something for insect, you know, something, uh, the fruit. <clears throat> so I think the half, you know, half a uh, human. Okay. Yeah. yeah, fair fair answer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's definitely interesting. Um, also, also, some sometimes he, he he catch the fish in the river. Mm. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. And he witnesses talk to me like that. 
Yeah. Okay. I got you. I see what you're saying. Um, do they, uh, do they, you know, do the same thing that these Sasquatches do here? Do these screw, do they, will they raid like crops and, you know, like in farm? Yeah. Or steal chickens, stuff like that. Yep. So they do, they do, they, they are, they are carnivores. Or om- yep. omnivores. So they do eat meat. I was wondering about that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Would if you had to? I mean, do you know? Like you know, I know here their favorite prey, in my opinion, would have to be what hogs or deer. Right? Yeah, I would say definitely deer and hogs where they are where they have hogs. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. What would you have to say, Ellie? Would be your, their favorite meal. My favorite meal, uh, I think um, insect because so many witnesses told to me when, when he go to forest, then he broke the tree and then eat, eat some insect inside, uh, inside the tree, you know, things like that. Like grubs and that kind of thing, yeah. The grab, yeah, the grub. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. <laughs> Interesting. It, it, it is. It really is. Suppose the it, appendix being smaller wouldn't need wouldn't need the high calories like something bigger you know they can yeah. live more of grubs and that kind of thing right yeah. right right i think some, uh, something like that yeah 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 now let me ask you a question i've always wondered this did they you know what we deal with here they tend to live in family groups what about on your side do they pen deck and get dang do they live in family Units or do they tend to live solitary lives? If you want to, so, an- you don't have to answer if you don't want to. But I, I was just asking if they, if they, you know, here they the Sasquatch tend to live in family groups. No, uh, maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe some family group from that. Them, but I think you know, like like I said before, this is a different location. Could be different type, and then maybe you know, in the Sumatra, the forest is uh, warm, which is not like Princess area. Princess area is very cold, you know, something like that, you know. And it could be yeah. that make yeah, that's make uh, make different this type of creatures, you know. Absolutely. So, uh, be, absolutely. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. There's actually a. Um, there's a Native American uh, uh, cryptid that is very talked about, uh, especially with the the Iroquois Nation. That res- that is very much like a ring Um and uh, you know, I I believe it's real. A lot of people will play it off as as bullshit, but I, I totally you know, there's a couple of them actually. Each tribe has a different name for it, but um, yeah, it's it, they're you know they look a little bit different, but they're they're short, you know. You you, not gonna... The stick people type type of thing. yeah, that that kind of thing, yeah. that kind stick, of thing. Yeah, stick, in, stick people. Yeah, 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 yeah. What are they? They suppose four feet, heard, three feet. I've heard anywhere from a foot to three to three feet, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Where uh, they're like a mini Sasquatch almost. Yeah, you know exactly, yeah. exactly, exactly. <laughs> Now, uh, facial now facial features on Pen Deck is it more human or more ape? The half, <laughs> I think the half, you know. No, yeah, I know that. But to, to, in you know, what do you do? They have you heard more people the say face. they look more the face? Face, like, face, face again. It's more like uh, human something. Some because I, I describe. Uh, from the witnesses, you know, described me from the witnesses. Sometimes it's like the human face, more like human. Mm-hmm. But uh, you know, uh, there is like four in in the uh, in hit face, you know. Yeah. Yeah, and, and they're not all going to look. The, they're not all going to look the same, you know. You yeah. know, like the three of us, we all look different, you know. So these things are, they're all going to have their own little look yeah. about them as well, as well. It's interesting yeah. that you said that that they more people say their face looks human because that's what we get here too with Sasquatch, you know. Yeah, we do. We have been lately. Uh, 
Yeah. The more, yeah. You're the right. Faith, you're right. You know, yeah. You're right. You're right. Yeah. I know, uh, you know, the, my encounters, I've they've looked as both. You know, I've seen when they look more ape, when they look more like human. So maybe that's my point. You know, they're all going to look a little bit different. Now, I think you did, I thought you told me, uh, you know, before, I uh, could have sworn Ranga Dang now looks very human, right? Very human, yeah, because also very from human. the footprints, you know, and then the yeah, stay yeah. The, yeah. Have you heard any uh, report? I, I know we're bombarding you. I, I know we're killing you with these questions, but uh, <laughs> um, have you, what's, what, this is as far as speed, you know, it, that these things can get up to, um, you know, running wise, you know, because we hear, you know, we hear these things over here getting up 50 miles an hour. I mean, can we, you hear anything on that over there? How, how fast these things can move? Yeah, fast thing move, you know. Also, in, the, in other areas, you know, when I, I put in the footprint, you know, and I heard something like uh, uh, like uh, people running in my back, you know. Yeah. So I, I take my cameras and I take some ra random photos in my back, you know. So after that, I come back to, to the home and then make a zoom out at, at my photos. And I, I, I feel there's something something creatures in the, in, in the tree, you know. I yeah. have started that. So I sent the photos to my friend, you know, maybe... <laughs> His name could be uh, Sean Parker. Could be what? Huh? From uh, I sent to my friend Sean Parker the, the pictures. Uh, oh, okay, the okay. Mm -hmm. And then after that, he makes some some you know some sketch, some sketch, and then it's like a more, more face, you know. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Two seconds. Second. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I can I can send to you also about the, the, the pictures if you want to. You want? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't see them. Just a second. Just a second. Just a second. Yeah, I know. I'm just playing it with it. Hey, Jeremiah. Yeah. yeah. Have you seen that video? Um, I, I, I went online and looked around today just and I found a video of people on a motorbike. On a yeah, trail. let's ask him about that. Yeah, you know what video I'm talking about? Yes, I do. Yeah. Yeah. It looks pretty compelling to me, but... Me I too. Just... Oh, I want to hear his thoughts on it. Yeah. Yeah. That thing was moving, dude. It was moving, yeah. It was moving good. It looked mm -hmm. like. <laughs> For sure. Huh? Not bad, Yeah, right there, Dolly. Yes. I'm looking for the file form to send to you, but the uh, pictures that uh, the Sun Parker sent to me. Awesome. Yeah. <clears throat> 
Maybe I can send to you by email after this. Yeah, if you send it to me, can, if you can send it on Messenger right now, I can pull it up on here. Yeah. I'm just looking on my computer. Okay, take, take your time, man. Take your time. Yep. Don't worry. I will send to you everything I give to you about, also about the footprint, if, if you want to. Uh, the type of footprint of the pandemic, also the classic uh, footprint of the pandemic as well from the Wangarang. Which one you want? You know, uh, my last my last last expedition, I, I found the the classic of the type of the round pendek footprint. You know, hello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you. We can hear you. Yes. Yeah, we can hear you. I got the, the, the type of in in the classic type. I, I mean in West Sumatra, you know, in, not in Kriji. That's maybe some confused, you know. But yes, the, the places in border are from the uh, Kriji and West Sumatra. The new area that I got. Okay. Uh, now, are, are they are they the, the two prints from the two areas? Are they the yeah. same? Or do, yeah. Or you, okay. like, like I said before to you, you know, I did some some explanation in in this project. So in uh, almost all of this Matra area, you know, it's like the when the first sighting of the Rampendek based on the classic uh, literature from the uh, Holland, you know, it told, it mm -hmm. told to that uh, the first sighting in the Bengkulu, it's not in Kurinchi, the first sighting of the Rampendek, you know, from the colonial time. After that, uh, yeah, the, the second if uh, in Kurinchi. Okay, see, a lot. I think a lot of people uh, think that the uh, first sightings were, were was in Kurinchi. Mm. Uh, in, so, in in nineteenth, in nineteenth, uh, Debbie Martha come to Kurinchi and then hit a she make some expedition as well as some research and then after that the Rapendi is like a more popular in Kurinchi than in Bengkulu, you know. I think so. okay. I think that I I don't know what what is the goal from the that reason, you know. I remember uh, actually. She now she, she saw one, didn't she? Sorry, didn't she see one? Me? No, uh, her uh, Debbie. Debbie. Yeah. Debbie. Yeah. You see, I think the three times she she talked to me like that because so when I was uh, making my book, I also put Debbie as the uh, speaker on my book. You know, mm -hmm. and then he talked to me. She talked to me. He, he, he saw the company the three times. First in Bengkulu and then second and then two in the Green Tea, you know. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Do you think you do you uh, uh do you still have a lot of uh now I, I, this is may seem, seem like a pointless question, but I'm going somewhere with this. Um is there still a lot of Sumatran tigers in Sumatra? Yes, yes. Okay, do you think that they ever have interactions, bad interactions? Mm, yeah, because you know, uh, I think he, he gets some frust uh, frustration uh, to to search the rope and uh, he, he climbed to see the rope and leg, but he can get he can get uh, the cameras, you know. So he changed his price project to uh, look for Sumatran tiger, something like that. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe he did this right, you know. <laughs> <laughs> now, have you, yeah, have you, have you, have you ever personally seen one? Yes. Would you mind telling us about it a little? Oh, uh, sorry. You you mean said the pendek? Yeah, pendek. Pen no, 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 no. Oh, no. myself. I, yeah, I'm, I'm never seen the pendek. Um, okay. In in person. Yeah. Okay. Because I, I was not lucky, you know. In 2009, yeah. I did some, yeah, I did some expedition with Adam Davis in forest, you know. Yeah. 
Me and Adam they split. Adam uh, Adam and me and going to another location, and then my friends uh, with Adam friends uh, going to another location. But my friend and Adam friends uh, saw the wrong planet. Not me and Adam, you know. Oh, uh, okay. I I I talked to Adam last night. Actually, he's a yeah. good he's a good friend, friend of mine. Yes, Adam is also a good friend because he, he teach me many things, you know, after uh, Cliff. That's my good friend as well because uh, Cliff is uh, begging me on the, for a couple of years for, to do some project in the Smart Science. Mm, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think uh, uh, yeah. he gave me yeah, some, um, ma- some money, many money, I think, uh, tons of money to do some expedition in Smart Science, you know, for a couple of years. And he, I, he, I, I, he, People don't understand to, to do what you do to go. You're 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 going into uh, the 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 most, most wild places in the planet, and it's just it's not just a day hike. You know, you're yeah. it costs money to do these to do these expeditions. You know, the, uh, people people don't get that. It, it's not just a hike in the woods for the day, and then you turn around and walk out. I mean, when you go in there, you're there, what, a couple of weeks? Yes, for, uh, I think, uh, yeah, for a couple of weeks, we went to the forest to look for uh, these uh, creatures, you know. And, and so, if, if we found the, some, the footprint in the forest, we follow the footprint very, yes, very far, you know. Sure. But, you know, like I said before, before we go to the forest, we did some ah. interview to local people to look for... Sure. Uh, uh, very very good information location and then what the creatures something like that so then we go to forest now yeah yeah i mean so they they do a lot like we do you know i mean you get you know gather gather your info and then you gather yeah gather your information talk to the locals and then they do your the uh, field work yeah 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 it's it's, it's interesting have you ever seen a uh Back to my, the question. Uh, I know you misunderstood me the first time, but have, have you seen you've seen a Sumatran tiger up close? Oh, not seen, but I think uh, it was like uh, uh, you know, this really, really uh, it's like bothering me in the forest, you know. I think yeah. something like that. Yeah, it bothering me is like uh, uh, when we stop in the. In the in, in, in the small house in the forest from the local people, and then it's like uh, makes uh, some sound in the our our uh, our camp, you know. That's for all the night, you know. So make me yeah. scared, and the next day I'm going to back home. I, I don't want to die in the forest, you know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't blame you because it's so dangerous, so dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And like, Dolly, can you guys carry a firearm there or, or no for protection? No, I, no? I don't think so. I don't, I don't think so. Okay. That's even scarier then because we, because we can over here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. And Which helps. You, you have to try. You have to try the next, uh, maybe someday uh, come to Swatra to look for the wrong band that things and like that. Yeah, I, I would love to go. I would love to make a trip over there and go out with you, man. I would love it. I I would love it. I would love it. If I ever come in and do uh, a good amount of money, you uh, plan on me coming over. So I'll go out. Yeah. I'll go out on an expedition. Yeah, I know Nate would too. Yeah. I've always wanted to go to. Do you think there's a connection between um, what they found on the uh, island of Florence in a rainbow deck? Sorry, you remember when they found a uh, homo uh, Florinian, Florinian, yeah, Florinian, uh, they call it the. Oh, yeah. Do you that think there's be, a connection? Maybe, maybe, maybe there's, yeah, maybe there's connection from the Flores, you know. Yeah. But okay. you know, when, when I think, but you know, until now, the open day, we have no proof, it's like a bone or something. We have only proof on the hairs, you know. Right, only right. Hairs, and then we did, we did, we did some some uh, test DNA in, in Copenhagen University. It, it, it was sent by Adam Davis, I think, but uh, 
DNA, they have human than half primate. So it did come back. Okay. Well, that's better luck than we have, have over here, you know. It always yeah, seems in, to uh, disappear. Is, so. Yeah. 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 So it did come back half primate. That's yeah. in, in, very interesting. Very interesting. Very interesting. Yeah. Um, uh, do you, you know, the, the, I know, you know, here they, a lot of people think it's fur that these coats are, but it's actually hair. Now, these things, is, is it fur, like a bear's fur, or is it hair like we have on our head? Yeah, some like uh, we have some hairs in the in the face and then uh, what, what, like that, you know. but you know in in West Matra, the my 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 uh, recent expedition also told to like uh, the witnesses told to me he has the veins. The creatures has the veins like this, you know. Oh, okay. Like veins, really? uh, because he saw the cross. He crossed the, the creatures from the, the road, you know, because the road is the meal with the forest, you know. Now, had you ever heard that before? No, that's the first time I got information about that. But I think uh, it's just like a more confused information because it could be the you, you, you can watch in my YouTube channel, you know, about yeah, oh, yeah, 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 with Daniel Antal, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I have several times, several times. Um, yeah, because that, that's I. That's the first time I went. I went picture when having canine. Very, very rare. We hear you'll hear of a Sasquatch with canines every now and then. But mostly, it's big blocky, big blocky teeth. But let me uh, let me ask you a question. Um, now we we have got this new phenomenon going on here the the the, do, the whole dog man phenomenon. Dog you, man, yes, dog man. I got. I, I also got this information from the West Matra, you know. Okay, so you do. There is. You guys are having the same kind of thing. Yes, I think. Yeah, like I'm still confused because uh, also I got no information for detail about these creatures as well. You know? No, I know, I, I know. I, I was just curious as to whether you guys, uh, you know, have heard stories of creatures like this as well. You know, interesting, uh, interesting. You know, like I said, because um, in, in Sumatra, many, many cryptids, you know. Also in Bengkulu, I got some information about the aquatic monkey, you know. About what? Aquatic monkeys. Aquatic right. Aquatic monkeys. Aquatic monkeys. Yeah. Interesting. Well, if, if you look, if you... I watched a documentary one time and it talked about the uh, um, the water ape theory. Have you ever heard of that? About what? It's called the water ape theory. Yes, water, water. Yeah, yeah that, that's, I mean, aquatic monkey, you know. Is that what you're getting at? I was been there to look for the information. Look it up later, Nate. Okay. Yeah. It's very interesting. I it's will. I was been there. Yeah. Okay. I, I thought that's where you were going with it. Yeah. It's that it's very, very interesting. Hmm. I mean, you know, who who knows how many I think there's a lot more, especially, you know, where you're at, you know, there, there's a lot more, probably a lot more cryptid than than people think, you know. Um, a lot, a lot more, you know, uh, it's just so, so vast. How, how big, as far as uh, Karinchi goes, how many, uh, how would you, how many square miles is the, uh, is the park? I'm not sure about how many is, you know, I think that, the, you know, I, I mean the Karinchi National, Karinchi National Park, I think that, okay. It was take uh, from the uh, West Matra as well, include that, and then also the part what uh, fifth part from the Gulu. Yeah. Okay, I got you. I got you. Uh, <clears throat> now, now uh, um, probably don't you know whether you want to release it 
vacation or not. I don't know. But when do you, do you plan on going on another expedition anytime soon? Or maybe next next uh, interview we can we can talk about the aquatic monkey. <laughs> Yeah, I, absolutely, absolutely. We'll let we'll let the viewers uh, read up on it a little bit first. But uh, the monkey, uh, yeah, that, even a uh, monkey is not the result expedition in because no result. But uh, I heard from the local people there is victim uh, by aquatic monkey. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, y yeah, Nate, it's it's very very interesting. It was, uh, I mean, yeah, I, it would take so long to go into it, but no, it, it, that's very, was this you no know, deep in the jungle or was this along the coat? The, are you talking freshwater product or uh, salt water? In, in aquatic monkey, you mean? Yes. Aquatic monkey is uh, on the river. Okay, uh, but uh, we have to do follow the river until until near the forest because uh, many people don't talk about the aquatic monkey stay in 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 water and then only uh, also when the people do some swimming in in river and then aquatic monkey catch them you know yeah yeah I, I scared in the ice carry that but yeah do you do you think they're real? I don't think so because. No? Uh, First, yeah, I don't, I don't think so because uh, I have no, no no good information from them. About no, gotcha. this. Uh -uh. Yeah, I'm not sure because we don't have the, some the good result because uh, only I think it, it is like the ghost thing like that. Yeah, yeah, like like na native na like we hear you know native lore. I un I understand what you're saying. Uh, yeah. Also, maybe the victim. That's only accidental. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. But still, I mean, it, it, I, I uh, when you said aquatic monkey, I kind of knew where you, I knew where you were. You were headed with it. Uh, it's still interesting, though. When I mean, you think about it, because the whole theory, the whole theory, could make sense. Uh, yeah. It, it could. I mean, uh, so all of you listening at home, make sure you. Uh, Google the aquatic monkey theory. Very, uh, very aquatic monkey and aquatic ape also. They're similar but a little bit different. Um, but no, man. Uh, you know, we always appreciate you coming on, Dolly. I always appreciate you coming on. I know you can't give up all. Uh, you know, can't really as far as telling your witnesses. You know, story. You can't. We understand, believe me, because we just we 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 don't really. You know, we we give our witnesses anonymity as well. You know, so. Um, but yeah, we sure do. Uh, we sure do appreciate it, man. You coming on? Definitely. We really do. We really do. Well, we thank love you very much for that. No, yeah, I'm so sorry because uh, I was thinking that. That we uh, we did some interview this on, on the night my time. Yeah. I, I don't think in, in the morning because in the morning I have to go some I have to go some work you know so little bothering you know. Well, I tell you what, 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 uh, what I I love to you know I want you know I'm gonna have you back on at some point. So what, what time is convenient for you? Yeah. So I'm so sorry about this accident. <laughs> What, no. what, what time? What, what time would be good for you? What time is it over there right now? A good for you is Saturday. Okay, so it's day. So it's so daytime there right now. Every time, in Saturday, every time. Saturday. Okay. Saturday and yep. and su Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. Saturday, Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. I know uh, India is like nine hours ahead of us in some spots. So what are you about ten hours? Ahead of us, nine hours ahead of us. Mm. So next time we'll make it more convenient for you. We'll we'll we'll, we'll run on your on your time. If if you want to do some uh, next interview, it's no problem. But I think I I think the the best time is Saturday. Okay. Okay. We can do that, ain't right? Yeah. Just just Saturday. Know, we, we can do it. Okay. All right. Don't worry.
Yeah, that that, that could that could work. I'd love to, love to have, you know. I always love having you on, man. You're one of my favorites. One of my favorites. Ah, uh, thank you, little bitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth, man. It's the truth. Uh, you were like I was telling Nate earlier uh, before this show became a show. You were you you agreed to come on when I before I had intro music before it was a professional show. It's all staticky. It was it was nothing but it was crap. I mean, you agreed to come on, man. So I will always respect you for that. Always. Okay, okay. can you send me uh, this recording to me? I will. I do, like you wanna, thing, yeah. I do you like want to? Do you want to before as well? You know. Yeah. Do you want it before it's edited, or do you want it edit, edited and then send to you? Yeah. So edit, get it. Wait till it's edited. I'll have it. Edit, I'll have it ready by tomorrow. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right, Dolly. Uh, we appreciate it once again, and thank you for hey, coming Dolly, on. It was nice to meet you, Dolly. Thank you for coming on. Appreciate it. Nice to meet you too, Nathan. Yes. yes, and I will be in touch, and we will get together on a Saturday at some point. Yeah, I'll, I'll, Very, I will send you some, some pictures on your Facebook, guy. Okay? Excellent. Nice. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. I'll, Thanks, I'll Dolly. Oh, right now, yeah. Okay, you have a good night, man, or a good day. <laughs> yeah, good night for you. <laughs> right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. All right. Take care. Bye. Take care.